The Middle East is one area that lags behind in gender inequality. Natalie Carney reports on what Turkey is doing to solve that problem. With all its attention to modernization, Turkey fails to impress in the area of gender equality. While there have been improvements, the country still remains the lowest ranking in Europe and Central Asia overall. In 1934, Turkey became one of the first European countries to extend its right to vote to women, 10 years before France. Yet since then, Turkey has fallen far behind other European countries in many areas of women's rights. A gender equality expert Chaydem Aydin says the country still operates very much like a boys club. In Turkey, in every area, women are underrepresented because men doesn't want to share their places, their positions with women. Men designed the politics, they are setting the rules, that's the problem. So it's very hard for women to fit into it. Government statistics show female participation in the labor force is currently just over 30 percent, while male participation is about 70 percent. Internationally, that places Turkey as the ninth worst country for women's economic participation. It fares slightly better in political empowerment. Zeynep Dalaman ran for mayor of Istanbul's most popular municipality in the 2009 elections, but is disappointed in the number of women who are running in local elections set for March. Uh, I cannot see any woman candidates. Uh, it's not uh, at the number of that I expect. Why do you think that is? Political party leaders decide who to be the candidate. Is that something behind the scenes or is that up in front? Behind the scene, of course. <laughs> there is still a cultural reality here that places Turkey at somewhat of a disadvantage to its European neighbors. A large part of it uh, is <laughs> cultural. Uh, relations are more traditional. Um, and to be an individual, it's more and more, more uh, difficult. Women's place is in the home. But changing this mentality is not easy. There is still a large portion of the population comfortable with the traditional norms. Yet the country has also spent two decades modernizing to meet European Union membership benchmarks, and gender equality is a big part of that. So while the World Economic Forum's report shows slow progress in Turkey, more and more women are trying to fight the cultural expectations and set meaningful examples for the country's future. Natalie Carney, CCTV, Istanbul, Turkey.